Hello everybody, did you know that JK News is also in podcast form for all you people out there that are fucking at the same time and listening to podcasts. Hey, hey. I heard that before. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure that if you guys want to check us out on the podcast, you can check on those links in the description box below. And remember to give us a good rating because we need that love. Some of us out here, not feeling loved. <laughs> in uh, food fight news, food fight. Submitted by Shady Steve. Shady Steve? Yep. Ooh, mm. that's shady. I don't know a Shady Steve, I just know a fantastic one. An innocent bystander to a restaurant scuffle wins a hundred thousand dollars after being in the face with pasta. Wow! Ooh. Assault with a deadly linguine. I would love <laughs> to get hit in the face with pasta. Oh, Me yeah, too. I'd have my mouth open. Oh, all right. Because I want to eat it. Okay. I don't get it. Not lasagna. It just sounded really weird. Because it's it'll be so hot. It'll You're a burn. mother. But I still like to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to make a second one. Okay. Nice. No. No, we're not. Oh my god. <laughs> Lost my appetite. No. Oh my god, you're crumbling it! No, I just did it because I. So I the next it. one's name is Tyco. <laughs> yeah. Tyka and Tyco. No, what was the original name that we have for Tyka? Torres! Torres! Can we please name the next one Torres? Yeah, you, you guys win. Yeah! Torres is a cute name. Okay, you got it. And they'll be like, what? Why? Tortilla and rice. Yeah. <laughs> there it is, dude. it's been decided. Rotilla, dude. Fuck, man. Rotilla. What if it's a girl? Huh? Rojota. Rojota. No, Rojota, dude. Rojita. 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 Yeah. All right, so this story is about this woman. She was eating at an Italian restaurant in Connecticut. As she was leaving, there was this lawyer named James Sweeney. Huh, who got fake in, news. Go ahead. Who got into an argument with another man. And as this woman was leaving, the lawyer picked up his full dish of pasta that had spicy sauce in it, lunged it at Would the plate too, or just was it like sass? That's a good question. I don't Does know. That be fucked don't up. The, the restaurant plates are thick. That's true. Donk. I think since he's a lawyer, he's probably like, knows it, so he probably just uh, grabs the plate and just only the he pasta. He probably felt the like the temperature of the pasta too. Like, yeah. oh, this okay, it's not that hot. It's not gonna burn it. Yeah. yeah. He probably tossed it up in the air, so it's not malicious either. Yeah. Mm. yeah. I, I don't know exactly how the toss went down. I don't know if the plate was still involved, but the whole point is that it did fit. It did hit this woman straight on her face. And it was spicy sauce, so she's saying that the sauce got into her eyes, causing her to hit her head, yep. get a concussion. Shit. I get it. Eye pain and neck pain and back pain. We've had a friend of ours put a bunch of sriracha in our eyes. Yeah. <laughs> it's not nice. Yeah. Fuck when I Are you guys recording so this shit? Okay. Yeah, we all know that pain. Yep. How, how do you get back? Shut the fuck up, cause I got the worst of it, and I did it to myself. <laughs> yeah. But you didn't have to swing the whole sriracha. Bottle. Hey, I it's forgot. Sriracha on the roof. Yeah. I forgot how much it hurt. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I forgot. It was in the heat of the moment. It's not. It's not what first degree murder. That's like fucking accidental murder. Which one is that? The fifth degree murder? No, I think Second? fifth degree. Murder. But it involves some burning, though. Maybe like first degree. Murder? Manslaughter. Oh. That shit was a act of passion. Mm. <laughs> if that was a gun, I'd been shooting myself too. What the fuck were they <laughs> arguing about? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they were arguing about. You're talking about this one, right? Yeah. I don't know what they were arguing about. Like, like what the fuck, man? I ordered fucking white wine, not Probably red wine. Anything. Lawyers love to argue. They do. They're probably just arguing all day and shit. Yeah, but a lawyer throwing a full dish of pasta. Hey, we saw a lawyer fucking tell a bunch of people to go back to Mexico and then we caught him again saying some other shit to other oh, people. Oh, he said some other shit? Oh yeah, yeah there's like the some, there was like some uh, yoga handsome model guy with his girlfriend and he was just vlogging and then that, that fucking lawyer guy was like, you fucking immigrants go back, this guy looks like a tall white guy. <laughs> and he's like, you fucking immigrants. The same lawyer? Yeah, the same one, cause he oh saw that video God. and he's like, Holy shit, I, this guy harassed me and my girlfriend. Whoa. Yeah, and then he posted that vlog. So he has oh. multiple shit. Like he goes around New York just being racial to white people too. I that was just he nuts. mariachi to his law firm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's my favorite part of that that's whole story. Dope. So he just doesn't know what he's doing. He doesn't even know how to racially profile people. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, he went up to a, a white guy, a, like with the fucking bun. Like the yoga white guy. Yeah. 
<laughs> with a man bun? Yeah, and he was telling him, he was telling him, go back to your country, you immigrant, fucking get out of my way and shit. And it was fucking like, what? His girlfriend's blonde as hell and shit. What? Were they speaking Spanish or something? No, they're just vlogging. They're just vlogging, like walking, and then he just comes up to him. He's like, "You're in my fucking way. Get off. Don't even oh. touch me or whatever." And then he just puts the camera there on. There are people out there that just need to be slapped. Oh yeah, Man. yeah. I don't Slap some sense into. Them. I think there's a lot of people like that. Not so much like the racist thing, but like how they just say whatever the fuck they want, and nothing yeah. happens to them nothing. all the fucking time, yeah. dude. I'm telling you, man. Because I think um, sending a mariachi. I mean, that's cool. You know, it's like the legal thing to do. But I really want to see him get fucked up. You know what they should have done? They should have just put a piñata in front of his face and just go full at it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That'll be tight. And then if he gets bam, hit, bam, you just bam, say what it is. Bam, 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 bam. You know? Yeah, so back to this lady here. So the jury awarded her $85,049 plus interest for a total of $102,550. Damn. I would never throw food that I just paid for. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. Yeah, I never think of using food as a weapon. That's like a that's like a thing of love, you know? Not, not even when you're angry? No, dude, there's like fucking free bread that they give at Italian places that are way harder. And there's forks, there's yeah. cups, knives, knives. There's those little fucking glass vases with the with the rose in it. Yeah, there's dude. tables and chairs. There's candles. Oh, you yeah. can... oh, we forgot about the chairs. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, the, the candles. Yeah. You take the napkin, roll it up. Light the candle, fucking throw it at that motherfucker. Put it in a wine bottle, Molotov. Wow. There we go. Oh, yeah. There's so many weapons. Oh, the fucking, go to the lobster tank and put it on their fucking face. Yeah. <laughs> Those vines. The back waistband that you can pull out. <laughs> so many things. I never think of food. Yeah, I don't think about throwing my food that I just paid for. I know. That's crazy. Like even if like I knew like the food could really hurt them, like a boiling hot bowl of pho, I would just go. Whoosh. I don't think the point is to hurt them. <laughs> <laughs> what if, what if you tried the food and it was disgusting. I still eat it. I pay for it. Yeah, me too. I think the point is to humiliate them. So like just to make to them. What look, humiliate. Oh. Yeah. But that's just a bitch movie. You know, like when they, when they oh, throw like the, the red wine. Yeah, yeah. Same. It's like, I'd rather give someone a black eye than like. Oh, got you. Yeah, yeah. It's super bitch. Movie. I think most people though they're worried about like lawsuits and stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm. Especially because these They should call them bitch suits. You know what they gotta do? They gotta do that hood thing. You know what I mean? Where they go outside and they just do this one. I, I fucking love ghetto people. I've seen this happen so many times. And it's just one phrase. Oh, by the way, people, if you haven't grown around ghetto people, if they say this one word to you, do not go to them. Let me talk to you for a second. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's all they gotta do. Walk outside. Yo, let me talk to you for a second. And then fuck their ass up. That's tight. They don't wanna talk. <laughs> They're gonna beat you up, dude. Outside. Take yeah. it outside. <laughs> what do you want to verbally tell me, huh? Listen, let me talk to you for a second. <laughs> <laughs> don't lean in yep, don't if you're not ready to fight. Yep. Mm. I sense animosity. You got a message for me? Yeah. My man. <laughs> I'm your man. <laughs> Guess we're friends. I'm going to keep my guards down and my fist fighting in my pockets. <laughs> you approach camaraderie in a really weird way. <laughs> Yeah, but this made headlines because it's just, it's so funny because she was just innocently walking by and she got awarded over a hundred thousand dollars. Man, what would I do with a hundred thousand dollars? For getting hit in the face with pasta. The free hundred thousand dollars. Did she get hit with the plate though? Yeah. She asked that earlier. I don't know. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't. I was just thinking of all the different weapons I could be using at a restaurant besides food. But I even said that before the weapon happened. Yeah, she did. I just picture like, Spaghetti getting caught right here, two meatballs. Like, all right. <laughs> it's a comedy show. <laughs> beep, beep. And the fucking nose is coming out with spaghetti. Oh, Last man. time you guys had Italian food? Yesterday. Did we? Oh, me too. I did. Oh, I wasn't there. Oh, what did I you I know we do everything together, but. <laughs> oh! I found a place in America that has the closest pizza that I've tasted to Italy. Ooh. It's called North Italia, and it's a chain. There's one in uh, Manhattan Beach, and there's another one in Newport Beach. Pretty bomb. The pizza, like the, because what really makes Italian pizza, I think, different from here, is uh, the pizza dough. It's really, really soft. Like you don't, you can eat like a billion crusts, and your jaw never gets tired. And this dough was like spongy and soft, and I'm like, damn. You know those Italian pizzas, though, man. Sometimes I look at them and I get a little mad. What? Because they're like, this is your margarita pizza. I was like, well, thank you for giving me ketchup and bread. So where the fuck is the rest of my shit? You know what, what you want? You want like, like a thick ass I, I would like cheese to cover the whole fucking thing. Oh, that's not and Italian. So they style. put like one dollop and then it's just all tomato and this little basil leaf. I'm like, well, yeah. fuck you, you bastard. What do you mean? It's a good banana. <laughs> 
What yeah, the fuck? How come it doesn't look loaded? Yeah! The Italian, Italian style Italian is not loaded. Sparse. Yeah. yeah, it's not loaded in Italy. When my dad uh, was traveling in Italy, um, he said that he had a really long day, and so by the time he sat in a restaurant, he saw pizza. He's like, oh man, I can't wait to have this pizza. So he ordered one, and the whole time he was just thinking of American style pizza. And when the waitress brought out the pizza to him, it was just like this thin crust thing of like bread and then there was just like some sauce and like little toppings on yeah, there and like, then my dad was like what the fuck is the pizza yeah I was like this is not is pizza it? but you know what's <laughs> dope funny. though that's where it started yeah but you, yeah. Yeah. That is pizza. but you know what's dope though because it's so light you can order like two or yeah. three different ones are they cheaper that's one that's like this big and that's like per person that's, that's smaller than a pan pizza you know what i like no, the best bigger, though beyond that kind of shit pizza. new york Pizza slices are my favorite. I like New York pizza too. It's delicious. Take that shit, fold it in half oh, yeah. like this, like a taco. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, I judge people that don't fold their pizza. Oh, really? You don't know how to eat pizza. I don't fold it. You don't know how to eat pizza. Which way do you fold it? Do you fold it horizontally or? It has to be folded <laughs> this way. <laughs> Julia, what? Like a roll? Yeah. It has to be folded. Do you have friends that do it horizontally? They do like both. This? Huh? Like this? Yeah. Like with the point like, is in? Yeah. I've seen some people like literally fold it in half, and I've seen other I've people seen like fold it one. like like symmetrically. If they fold it that way, you have to slap them. <laughs> <laughs> symmetrically? It, it, no. Are you telling us right now that's what your boyfriend does? Then leave no. him. No. Fucking leave him now. <laughs> no. Run, Julia, run. no. 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 So like those real big pizzas, though, have I have to fold, to fold like those, fold but yeah. the regular this one, way. like so hot dog, right? Not hamburger. Do you know what I mean? You don't fold a hamburger, do you? No, I mean, I've seen people fold it like Oh, you gotta slap it out of their hands. Yeah, that's what I'm like, who does that? That's, that's I've seen it though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like one of the most upsetting like the things I've ever heard in my life, dude. Yeah, yeah. They bring the tip to the they, crust? They, it's yeah, like this. I've seen people do that. And then they that. eat it like that, yeah. You know what you just told me right now? What? It's like you literally just told me you got a hamburger and you flip the buns inside out and you <laughs> and you ate it. That's what you just told me right now. Yeah. There's probably oh, someone, else, there's someone watching right now that's like, I eat pizza that I way. Know. Hey, I don't judge. You gotta slap they it. They eat it however they want to eat it. It's fucking Everyone madness. Everyone else in this room judges. Like, I prefer not to fold at yeah. all. Do you put yeah. the, the sandwich meat on the outside or the inside? <laughs> 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 what's, what's, what's going on here? When you get a double double, do you prefer the meat on the outside? <laughs> yeah. Do you don't hang out with those people <laughs> anymore. You hang out with us. Do you understand? <laughs> We're good people here. Do you like your drink outside of the cup? Yeah. She's on changed the floor? ever since she left the iPhone gang and then went Android. Yeah. It's been a different yeah. Julia. We just we're not connecting anymore. By the way, update. I'm getting a Pixel 2. That's still not an iPhone though. It's still a really coming in today. 